Michelle Birdie Brett is a devoted fan of the Carpenters. So devoted, in fact, that she and her husband created a show of Carpenters music with Michelle taking on the recognizable voice of the late Karen Carpenter. The show is called We've Only Just Begun, Carpenters Remembered. And here's entertainment guru George Pinocchio with more. Karen Carpenter left us in 1983, but the music of the Carpenters lives on. And now singer Michelle Birding Brett is coming to town for one night only with a show that celebrates the life and legacy of Downey's most famous residents. It's a love letter to the Carpenters because definitely Karen was the face for the band and she was the one that the audience connected to. Um, but Richard was, I mean, such a musical genius. Just like me. Just to you. We don't do an impersonation in our show, uh, but definitely what we've tried to create is um, a, an absolute true representation of the arrangements that Karen and Richard did. She sang so simply and uh, as I like to say, she imbued every single word with so much emotion. And, um, and really, and as a result, those lyrics and those melodies just have a classic timelessness. Taking on the Karen Carpenter thing, though, I'll tell you what. I, there were times when I really did question my sanity because it's really, she makes it sound so easy. Michelle told her producer husband that her dream was to do a show featuring all Carpenter's music. He said, let's do it. Now, we don't have children, this is our baby. So here we are and we're playing Downey. Oh my God. <laughs> We've only just begun, Carpenter's Remembered does touch on Karen's passing. For most of us, the death of Karen Carpenter meant it was the first time we heard about eating disorders. Mm -hmm. She put a face to it. So definitely we mention it in the show, but most of all we try to, uh, we try to keep it upbeat and really focus on their musical legacy and what they've left us. We've only just begun. Carpenter's Remembered plays for one night only, Saturday night at 8 o'clock at the Downey Theatre in Downey. She sounds great, though. Michelle sounds really, really a, a lot like Karen Carpenter. Yep. Pretty neat.